Welcome, welcome, welcome. Today we're going over how long it will take to see your credit improve once you pay off debt. As usual, it's not all black and white. It depends on the type of debt, the specifics of your credit portfolio, and when the creditor reports the account status to the credit bureaus. And sometimes paying off debt doesn't improve your scores and might even lower them. What? It's nuanced, so let's dive deeper. Your credit card balances make up your credit utilization ratio, which is how much your available credit you're using at a time. If your total credit card limit equals a thousand bucks and your balance equals 500, your credit utilization ratio is 50%. So aim to keep it below 30% or in the single digits to be elite. Paying off a credit card drops your credit utilization, which shows on your credit report within 45 days. Also, try to keep cards open because closing them lowers your amount of available credit. And if you have balances, it will make your utilization ratio go up. Installment loans like mortgages and auto loans have a set term with fixed monthly payments. When a borrower makes the final payment, the account is closed. Now, this is where it gets funky. Paying off your installment loan may not help your credit score much, and it may even cause a temporary drop. That's because part of your credit score is your credit mix, which is having different types of credit, not just credit cards. But don't fret. The score drop usually only lasts a couple of months. And even if it doesn't go back, if the account closed in good standing, you will have that positive history on your credit file for 10 years which will help in the long run. While we're talking about things that stay on your credit report, let's discuss some of the icky stuff we wanna keep away from that having long lasting impacts. When a significantly late payment on a loan or line of credit is reported to the credit bureaus, it stays there for seven years. Past due debts that go into collection stay on your report for seven years and really hurt your credit. Chapter 13 bankruptcy remains on your credit report for seven years and chapter seven stays for 10. Foreclosures, repossessions, and debt settlement also remain on your report for seven years. Before I sign off, here's a quick breakdown of credit score factors and their weight. Payment history is 35% of your score. This is whether you pay bills on time. Credit utilization is 30%. Credit history is 15. This is how old your accounts are. The longer you have a good standing credit account, the better. Credit mix is 10%. This is how much credit diversity you have, like credit cards plus a mortgage. And finally, new credit is 10%. This is how many credit lines have you opened recently. And when you apply for a new loan or credit card, a hard inquiry is run on your credit and has a small temporary impact. And that's it. Paying off car debt and keeping those balances low has a significant impact on your credit and you can see the difference quickly. Paying off installment loans is a bit more nuanced, but remember to stay on top of your credit. Check your credit scores for free with Experian. Stay tuned for more videos and help me pay off this video, please, by hitting those like and subscribe buttons. And check out Experian.com and I'll see you next time.